VIP-2 is top priority. You are clear for whatever measures you deem fit. These orders have the highest possible authority. Reinforcements are on the way. We need VIP-2 alive, understood?
Inbound. We need you to move to the LZ. Captain, Bravo is on the move to the LZ with VIP 2 for extraction. HQ, this is Blackhawk 4. We've got Alpha and Bravo in the air with VIP 2. Repeat, extraction successful. Welcome aboard, Captain. Senior Presidente. I'm General Martin, and I have operational command of forces on the ground. Seems you're already in contact with General Keating. Captain, looks like you did a great job down there. My gratitude to you and your men knows no end. And you can be sure of my full cooperation. This country must be put back in the hands of its people. I can assure you we're working beside many brave Mexican soldiers who want the same thing, Senor Presidente. General, we've got incoming video. Patch it through. And we also received word moments ago that the U.S. Embassy sustained an attack by rogue forces. They were repelled by soldiers loyal to the Mexican president, who has reportedly asked for limited American assistance to quell the insurgency. We've now also confirmed that Colonel Carlos Ontiveros, who many believe is one of the leaders of this rebellion, received his military training on American soil. WINSEC is a U.S. school for Latin American military officers, and Ontiveros's training there could conceivably make him as qualified as his American counterparts on the ground. In the studio, we have retired Colonel Michael Blaché to discuss what might be happening on the ground. General, I trained Ontiveros five years ago at WINSEC. We were together at the Combined Arms Center in Kansas. What can you tell me about him? He was first on the course every day. He feared nothing. He's the cleverest and the most vicious student I ever had. Okay. We are working closely with those in the Mexican military still loyal to President Ruiz Peña and have identified seven key zones of engagement. These are your assignments. Jennifer Burke will take the airport. We have reports of rebel ADAs. We need those cleared before we can get the president into the air. Salvatore will be responsible for the shanty sector. David Foster will proceed to Chapultepec. We need to secure those tanks. And finally, Captain Mitchell, I'll need you for something a little bit special. The rebels have set up a strong point on the hill overlooking Avenida Suarez, essentially blocking our movement into the city. It is a very well entrenched position with overwatch of the entire street. That position must be neutralized. In all, we've identified multiple hard targets. We've ID'd bunkers on the camp's perimeter and a couple of towed anti-tank batteries. We suspect mortars and machine guns, but cannot confirm any numbers at this time. Your mission will be to secure the zone 
and open up the highway. We can't move until you've cleared it out. Understood? Look sharp, Scott. We have movement all around you. There's lots of activity on the ground. Mitchell, Bravo will take one DCA and you'll handle the other. You should have the coordinates now. The closest DCA is approximately 500 meters from your position. Let's move it. We've got a hot signature emanating from a fixed location in your zone. It's most probably a scrambler. Captain, we have multiple hostiles between us and the target. We need them eliminated so we can get a clear shot at that DCA. Let's do it! Bravo here. Target destroyed. Standing by. Mitchell, got a present for you. We have a ghost sniper support team, Charlie. Just arrived in theater. They'll be on the ground in minutes to provide cover. Now get me a clear sky! Captain, Charlie team in position and waiting on targets. Satellite takes a rebel camp near your position. Housing two artillery pieces. We'll need those taken out. Bravo, the camp is powered by a generator. Two clicks, two east to your position. Take out that generator so Ghost Fleet can operate under cover of darkness. Bravo team here. Roger that. 
We are now en route to generator. One click due east of the camp. We'll advise when we're in position. First class work, men. The rebel air defense is down, and Apache support is inbound to clean up whatever obstructions are left. Look sharp. Multiple targets! I have visual on target.
target. Mitchell, once Bravo puts the lights out on the camp, you should have adequate cover to use C4 and those two rebel artillery assets. <laughs> Captain, this is Charlie. We've got a little present for you in the works. A diversion to distract these guys while you enter the camp. We are go on lights out. Uh, Charlie, this is Bravo. What you got in mind? Charlie and the Bravo. Spoil the surprise? Never. You do your job, and you'll get to watch ours. Over. Waiting on you. I have visual on target!
Nice work. One more to go. Bravo to Ghost Leader. Listen, we've got confirmation on Rebel Barracks about 200 meters from our position. Intel says that Colonel Valdez may be there. We can take it out before we secure the extraction point. Your call. Mitchell, I need to get you and your men out of there. But that Rebel Barracks is a problem. We'll have to deal with those rebels now or later. It's your call, Captain. Bravo here. Captain, we're still awaiting confirmation on whether to hold off on primary objective or destroy that rebel barracks. If we don't hear from you, we will proceed to the extraction point. Bravo to all units. Target eliminated. We had a visual on Colonel Valdez, but he has left the scene. We're now moving to the extraction zone. Well done, Mitchell. Let's get you boys out of here. We've set an extraction point. You should now have the coordinates. Bravo will secure the area. Bravo team has arrived at the extraction site. It seems to be occupied, Captain. We have multiple hostiles, but I think we'll be able to clear the zone.
ground. The LV is now clear and we're gonna put her down. Bulldog, VIP-1 must get airborne. What's the holdup? Airspace is still not secure for takeoff. Suggest we hold VIP-1 until my best and brightest can finish the job. Okay. I've now got VIP-1 on the line. He agrees. Out. Men, Camp Chapultepec is the assembly area for Mexico's 50 M1A1 tanks, our contribution to the North American Joint Security Agreement. Since the Mexicans haven't repainted them yet, I don't see why we can't borrow one. Or a couple. Captain David Foster will have operational command of this mission. Blackhawk 4, copy. En route to Camp Chapultepec. We have incoming video. And to further complicate an already chaotic situation in the capital, General Antiveros is now claiming legitimacy for his coup by asserting that the North American Joint Security Agreement is unconstitutional and that the Mexican president has no legal right to sign it. General Antiveros has also appealed to the United Nations to, quote, protect the sovereign borders of Mexico's legally constituted government from an unprovoked U.S. invasion. Unprovoked my ass. We just saved your president's life. In what way is General Antiveros's position legally constituted, Jen? Well, Jack, we're now being told that he was sworn in minutes ago in a private ceremony that will soon be broadcast on state television. We're also hearing disturbing reports of reprisals taken against civilians in many government ministries, which would make whatever claims Antiveros has for his government's legitimacy highly unlikely. Ground radar is painting us. I don't think it's friendly. They have a lock! Blackhawk 4 going full evasive, dropping chaff, dispensing flares on auto. Mitchell, man the door gun! This is getting hairy! We're gonna have to withdraw! We're hit! Ugh, it's bad! Mayday, mayday! Chinook Alpha 3 is hit! Rear rotor's losing power! We're losing fuel pressure and altitude! Mayday, mayday, mayday! We've got a Chinook hit! Repeat, Rebel ADA has denied area for our air assets. Look lively, Mitchell. We are getting ripped apart up here. Can't hold it! Mayday! Mayday! This bird's gone down! Blackhawk 4, what in the hell's going on? I need a sit rep! This is Blackhawk 4. We've got a Rebel ADA on the ground. Lots of AAA and a few shoulder launched. The sky is full of tracers! Two Chinooks hit. One is a total loss. We need air support to take Chapultepec, so I need the enemy AA suppressed. Cleared! And I mean, now! Captain Mitchell, can you make this happen? We're gonna put her down, hang on tight! Coming in fast and hard! Those trees, put her down there! Prepare for insertion in 10 seconds! 9, 8, 7, now! Mitchell, we have a bird down! Bravo and Beasley must secure the Chinook crash site now! So you'll have to go solo and neutralize those Rebel ADAs! Move it, people! Understood, sir. Crash site to be secured. End of the ride, Scott. I need three mobile air defense artillery batteries shooting at us on the way in. So you've got to neutralize those threats. This bird is not equipped for the fight, so we'll stay back and wait for your word.
We've got three mobile ADA units, Scott. All three objectives must be destroyed. Black Ops 4, this is Barnes at Crisis Center. Three mobile units confirmed. We do not have a current fix on two of them. We are checking our systems. We'll have an update for you shortly. Copy that, Crisis Center. Use ground assets to destroy the mobile targets. I'd suggest your counter snipe, Scott. locate the two remaining mobile batteries. The enemy is using ECM and scrambling the entire zone. No intel in or out. Mitchell, if you can blow the transmitting station that's jamming our comm system, we'll be able to locate those DCAs. If not, you'll have to eyeball them on your own. Your call. That's one. Two more to go. Blackhawk 4, tell me you got updates on those ADAs. We need a target location. Now that's a negative, Blackhawk 4. Our comm system is jammed and we are exploring all possible sources. The Rebels may have taken our guardrail 9 and wired it up.
There's still one mobile target active. You've got to take it out. What's the holdup? We need those batteries taken out. This is Black Hawk 4. Captain Mitchell has neutralized the hostile air defense. We are air mobile again. Copy that. We have stationary artillery inside the castle near Chapultepec's west wall. Heavy stuff. Mitchell, we need to relieve pressure from that hostile artillery. Castle entrance is well guarded. Stay sharp. Captain, this is Black Hawk 4. The castle gates appear to be closed, but we've got air support en route. And those boys use one hell of a knocker. Affirmative, Black Hawk 4. Apache 1 is on the way. General, this is Black Hawk 4. Captain Mitchell has infiltrated the castle. This is General Martin. I need those heavy artillery pieces taken out. They're getting hit damn hard. Copy that, General. Mitchell, your objective is to use demolitions. Neutralize those artillery pieces.